In this video, I'm going to show you how we can merge patient files together. Once we've given you permission to merge the patient files, um, you'll be able to do that from the patient directory and go to find duplicate patients and then click find duplicates below. The most important thing before you merge duplicate files is you must check that they don't have an upcoming appointment or there is a possibility that the patient file could be open somewhere in the clinic. The reason for this is if you merge a patient file and it's open somewhere else, it can cause a glitch um, that we need to fix up from our back end. So we just ask that you be really diligent and make sure that uh, you minimize the possibility of having the patient file open. If a patient has an appointment um, on the day, then we recommend that you hold off on merging until the following day uh, to avoid the possibility from happening. So once you've brought up your list of find duplicate patients, what we wanna do is they will appear in here if they have exactly the same first name and last name. So if they don't have the same first and last name, then they won't appear in this list. You might need to manually go back into uh, the patient files and make the names exactly the same. You'll need to remove the date of birth on one of the files in order to save it because the system won't allow you to create an exact duplicate. Once the patient appears in this list, the next thing to do is to type in the search the patient's name. So we're only bringing up the two files that we're merging. Again, just minimizing the risk of merging into the incorrect patient file. So let's do John Doe. Now, what we need to make sure is we need to make sure that all the contact details and the date of birth are the same in both patient files because it's gonna get rid of one of them. So once they are exactly the same, what we can then do is we will select the oldest patient file usually, and we wanna keep that one on record. So the one that we wanna keep on record, we select first. You'll need to hold down your control key and then select the second file. That second file is going to merge into the first one. So once we've selected it, then you will be able to press merge and then press OK. This particular test account doesn't have access to merge patient files, hence why it's grayed out at the moment. 